welcome back to my channel today i'm bringing you a what's in my book bag video just a couple backgrounds i am a senior in college i graduate next may my major is social work and yeah i don't know why i just now decided to make um school videos i have tried three different times at a youtube channel this is my longest that i've attempted at one so we're going you're going to get school videos this year vlogs study with me you know different tips and tricks i do have a college q a in the works so if you have any college oh i'm on a breath if you have any college questions anything you need advice on leave them down below and i will answer them in my q a but let's get right on to what I have in my So, I have this North Face book bag that I just got. My sister gave it to me. And so, let's see what we got in the front pocket. So, in the back pocket is three pockets. So, in the big back, in the pocket in the back, you can only tell is my laptop. This is, ooh, this is my laptop case. It's silver and rose gold. And then this is my... Laptop is an HP X. It's the HP Envy X something 360. Um, it it's an okay laptop. It is starting to start to have some trouble. I had it for a year now, and it's starting to, you know, crack and um overheat and stuff. So I do need to get it fixed. But overall, it's a very good computer. It's touchscreen and. The only other part I don't like it is that it's only the battery only lasts four hours, so you constantly have to charge it. But that's okay because it's mainly a school laptop. Um, next pocket, I have all this stuff, and that's where everything is. So the first thing I have is this big, big, big. Now everything that I am about to show you is from Target. I have this big thing of post-it notes. I am a planner and I love post-it notes so I have the little post-it notes the big ones the right things on the regular size ones this is wonderful if you know you need to write down stuff in your planner you need to write down stuff in your book as you're studying and oh I am so glad for these the only thing I don't have is tabs like the little page flags but I have a bunch of those so don't need any more the next thing I got is the my favorite pins is the pilot g2 pins and they are so cute and they come in various colors and it says that I have a bonus pin, which is the Friction Erasable Pin. You can't really tell, but these are the best pins to me. They write so, so well. And they make my handwriting so pretty. I look really sweaty, but I promise I'm not. <laughs> um, then the next thing I got was a pack of colorful highlighters. Like I said, I am a planner. So I love colorful things in my notes, and I love colorful things in my planner. So, you know, so I can color code which classes is which, which homework goes where. Everything to keep me organized and ready for school. And it has two pinks, two yellows, an orange, green, blue, and purple. Okay, next three things is just your regular college rule notebooks. Um, in college, you don't really need, you know, a specific ruled notebook or anything. It all really depends on your professor and how the professor does notes. Personally, I like to write my notes, and I like to um, color code. So, I just got to pick up a couple of notebooks just in case I need them. I don't know if I actually need them. These were 99 cents each, so I couldn't pass them out. But like I said, it all depends on your professor and your teachers on whatever, you know, supplies you need for school. College is really, you know, whatever. Um, next up, I have college ruled filler paper. It's upside down. College rule filler paper. This is for my binder. I also do binders where I keep like notes and stuff, PowerPoints and whatnot, and like extra paper just in case the teacher is like um hand something in really quickly and you don't want to rip out paper from your notebook. So get some extra paper just in case, you know, for things like that in like a separate folder or in a binder. Um next up I have um a one and a half binder in yellow you see the colorful scheme that's going on i'm trying to be bright with my stuff um yeah this is like i said this is for notes powerpoint notes or like extra paper or um whatever i usually take a binder like last semester i had a binder and i split up each class in the binder 
so that I knew where every note was, all the syllabi, all of everything. So I'm going to do that again with this semester and keep everything in one binder so I know where everything is and I have this notebook here, this folder here, you know, all that stuff. And then in the, in the middle is a pack of dollar mechanical pencils. You will always need just at least a pack of pencils for his test and scantron because teachers do not like when you do test and pen and usually in um college they are multiple choice scantron and so you have to have a number two mechanical pencil or just you know a wooden pencil just make sure you have a pack of pencils on hand for test and or like if you're doing math if you have a math class luckily i am done with math um next up is a planner it's a 2019 planner they didn't have any 20 20s but that's okay i just need it for this semester and it's so cute hold on um i kind of won't be needing it i will just be needing it for the rest of the thing but it has like a full monthly coverage and then the week the days are like oh you can't even see this but the days are pretty you know big so i can write um uh, my assignments and i'm very very glad that that is that big because my handwriting is very big so get you a planner you know or a bullet journal whatever suits you to write down assignments write down important dates and details so you can be ready for your first day and then next i have like the little index dividers for the binder so i can label what class is what and those were just like 99 cent at target and then lastly i have a pencil pouch for my pens i also have another pencil pouch with um like emergency stuff girl stuff you know feminine products stuff like that for to read books on so this thing i have is my tablet and it's really a kindle fire and this is to read textbooks online if you know because i'm not paying for textbooks i will scan <laughs> one of the hacks is to not buy books if you're gonna if you need a book for class ask somebody in your class to go to the library and scan it and then send all those scans to your pdf i mean to your email in a pdf that's hat <laughs> that's what i'm gonna do this semester that's what i've been doing the past couple years because i refuse to buy books i am not buying books i'm sorry i am not about to pay 200 dollars for a book that i'm only gonna need for three months you know so that's why i have a kindle fire to read documents and or books or you know just read for fun because i like to read and yeah, I am really loving this rose gold case. Oh my god, I am loving it so much. Then the next thing I have is my rose gold beats. I have them for, you know, when I'm listening to music, while I'm studying, or just, you know, on campus, walking around to class to class. Um, I usually don't wear these outside of campus, like outdoors, because <laughs> I'm nervous that somebody's going to jack me for them. These bad boys are too much money to get stolen. So I like to keep them in this little package with the extra cord with it and a charger and keep them in my book bag and just use them when I'm inside doing homework or at home. And the last thing I is a water bottle and guys, make sure you always have a water bottle. Make sure you're high, make sure you're hydrated and make sure, you know, you just have a reusable water. Save the planet. Um... As you can see, guys, I have a purplish, girlish theme, colorful theme. Like I said, I'm trying to be girly. So, yeah, that is everything. I That's pretty much it. That's everything that was in this book bag. I am so excited to start school. I start school August 27th, and oh, I'm just so excited. I just love school shopping, and I love, you know, getting all the new stuff, opening everything, using everything. <sighs> guys, I cannot wait. Um... So be on the lookout for my college Q and A. Like I said, um, if you have any questions, if you have any tips, if you want any tips, if you want any tips and tricks and secrets, if you're you know an incoming freshman or a senior like me, you still need help. Just you know, let me know. Leave everything in the comments below. And guys, in my next video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video.